With Kampachi, you want to slice it as thin as possible? No, I know. The reason for that, of course, is that Kampachi's got a lot of tooth to it, right? So the, yeah, the thinner it is, the yeah, easier it is to enjoy. It's a little bit more firmer, but it has very good flavor. A lot of nice fat. Yeah. So we're just going to do about six to seven slices. Okay. About three to three and a half ounces. On the menu, this is an appetizer or a, a family style of, uh, item? Uh, this is an appetizer on our uh, sushi page. Okay. Terrific. Yeah, so next... that, that, that's enough for me. Yeah, that's, that's, <laughs> that's, that's, about, that's about the size of an appetizer. Okay. okay. And then next we're going to make our sauce. So we got olive oil. We got rice wine vinegar. And we got white soy. What do we got here? And that's sugar. Sugar. And then we got some yuzu kosho. Yuzu kosho. So this is basically shishito peppers and a little yuzu mm -hmm. made into a paste. Pretty spicy? Uh, a little bit. Okay. It, has, it has a bite. You definitely can't eat it by itself. Oh, okay. You'll, you'll, you'll make that face. <laughs> and then we got a little bit of kosher salt. And then black pepper. And this sauce is really easy. Basically, all you want to do is stir all the ingredients together. This is a really um, simple dish. Simple is good. Sometimes simplicity is, is the one. So once we have it all stirred together, we, that's pretty much it. Okay. Next, we have some garlic aioli. This is roasted garlic, lemon juice, a little bit of Tabasco, salt and pepper. Mayonnaise. And mayonnaise. Yeah. I'm just going to dot this on top. Then we got some pickled radish. So basically, this is, I just make pickling liquid with a uh, Chardonnay. Rice and vinegar and sugar. Okay. Some nice spices. Yeah. And we got some kuku sea asparagus. So you can find this in any supermarket. Yeah, it's good stuff. Pretty much. I really like it. We got some jalapeno. So Jason, what's your favorite fish to eat? You only get one. Moi. Moi, yeah, I'm if with you, you. If you can find it. Yeah. Yeah, and then you every, whenever you make a sashimi dish, always should finish it with a little bit of Hawaiian salt. Just just to, just to a little bit on the top. And then grind some micro cilantro. Just remember this sauce. Always gotta, always gotta stir it before you, before you serve it. Yeah. Just wanna spoon it on last minute. Yeah, that's it. Nice job. You're making this look pretty easy. It's pretty easy. Tell you what, chef. Let's take a break, and when we get back, we'll give it a try and let everybody know how we think about this. Okay. All right. So, folks, don't go away. We'll be right back to let you know how this, this works out. Can I take a picture? That's good stuff. Hi, welcome back to the show. If you just joined us, we're with Chef Jason from the Waikiki Roy's restaurant. Good to have you, man. Thank you. Please explain to us what you just put together for us. So we basically have a kampachi crudo, kuku sea asparagus, jalapeno, and it's a yuzu kosher white soy. All right, come on, man. That aioli's gonna be nice with this, I bet. Aioli's gonna be nice. Boy, is that good. Boy, is that good. Folks, you gotta try this. This is, this is terrific. Good job, man. Thank you. Thanks for being with thank us. You. That is awesome. And folks, we'd like to say thank you to everybody else who participated on today's program. It's not gonna be that long. We'll see you about a week, right back here on Let's Go Fishing. Man, that's terrific.